What's up guys, so I have a really cool app that's called uh, Solve It and uh, it's for your uh, uh, for a 2x2 cube, for your 3x3 uh, uh, three three and a 4x4 and, a four four. Um, and also uh, for your void cube, if you have a void cube that's also for that, so and uh, what it does is solves your cube um, mainly for the 3x3 three three. it's like this one, standard 3x3 three three. so basically what this app does is uh, solves uh, your 3x3 uh, three three cube in less than um, in 20 moves or less uh, could be either um, somewhere around 20 moves, could be um, one less or um, like either 19 or 18 and it could be uh, 21 or 22, maximum is 22 to be uh, solved on a 3x3 three three. and there are 20 I mean, uh, there are 22 maximum of uh, steps to do to solve this cube from any position so so it doesn't matter how scrambled the cube is uh, this app will find a uh, solution uh, from uh, any step that uh, you just scramble it and you just and put colors on here and uh, you uh, just put that um, um, right on the uh, here's a 3x3 three three. You, you have colors here just, uh, just use that um, but, but hang on a second let me get to this in a minute um, I just want to show you something else that's really cool here um, you can also make uh, cool patterns uh, for the 3x3 three three and 4x4 four four. So this is a 3x3, three three. you can make cool patterns uh, here and as well as 4x4. Four four. There's some really cool patterns that you can uh, uh, make that uh, you just hit whatever uh, it's, uh, you want to try to do. And let's just pick for example uh, that and uh, whatever. <laughs> um, it just tells you in the image uh, what to do there. Anyways, uh, you can uh, get to that uh, some other time. But anyways, but this video is mainly for uh, for you solving your cube for the three by three. So, so let's get to that uh, right now. I'm going to go to solve cube and uh, go to cube three by three. And so here's what I'm going to do. Um, so pick. Pick any position you want, just, uh, you know, randomly. I'm going to choose, oh, let's do... Let's do the green side for the first couple of cells, but we're just going to... Um, or should we choose another one? How about... Actually, I'm going to choose blue, from being at the top. Like that. Okay, I'm going to... Um, so basically what it's saying, this is the front side, so, so if you're doing front, whoops, so if you're doing front, so no colors are matching here, just doesn't matter, just put, just, here's what you do, so basically what, so what it's saying is you have to like input colors, uh, actually you have to put, manually put it, I'm gonna put white, blue, yellow, white, red, yellow, white, green, orange. Now go to the next, go to the next side. So just turn the cube and go to the next side. So, um, so again, so blue, white, yellow, blue, yellow, red, green, red, blue. As you can see it matches exactly how I'm putting it. So, so again I'm gonna turn the cube here and uh, that's the other side here. So red, green, blue, then the yellow, orange, white, red, orange, white, 
there it is <coughs> so there you have it so so far I've got uh, got three sides so this is this is uh, another side so here it is I just turned it to the other side so yellow green red orange white green orange yellow orange and before you go to the top don't turn it don't turn over here because that would be a mistake that would be a you wouldn't uh, so before you go do this one so turn the cube again to the front face the where you started it which is like the which is this face here for example so and now you can turn it over here to the top and then match up what you have on the top there so it's for me it's uh, orange red uh, green yellow blue red why uh i mean green then white and red red uh, and, th and now turn to the bottom side uh, green uh, orange yellow orange green blue 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 and white so there you have it uh, there you have it so now I have entered uh, all of my uh, uh, cube uh, and right exactly uh, exactly how my cube appears. So it has to be on on this face here. So if I click, if I hit the uh, solve button here, so let's hit the solve button and uh, and look at that, 21 steps. The the two X means that you have to turn that twice. For those of you who don't know, just and that means you have to turn it turn the layer twice. So uh, so basically, what this uh, what is saying is well, instead of having the algorithms, it actually drawn for you um, in in image style. So so here it is. So let's do number one. So number one is saying you have to turn cube like so this way this is the front face now bottom side let's see if I can do this with my one handed so uh, one two now one two now again, one, two, and now number five, one, oops, number six, number seven, that is that way, number eight, like so. Number nine, um, like, like so. And number ten goes twice. One, two. Number eleven is back once. Right. Um. So, number twelve we got. to be like this one two number 13 like that like so 14 fr uh, front face twice 15 um, one two uh, 16 one. Two, uh, seventeen, uh, eighteen, one, two, nineteen, one, then one, two, 
and boom solved with one hand one handed solve <laughs> but yeah I was just uh, following along with this image here and uh, boom solved it in like 20 21 steps so there you have it so if you uh, want to try it out uh, give it a try um, just make sure you're not uh, mixed up with colors to input colors there just, uh, but yeah there you have it uh, solved in 20 ish some moves um, specifically here 21 but uh, but like I said highest for the 3x3 is uh, 22 steps but uh, other than that it's gonna be maybe less than that uh, but uh, around 20 moves you can solve this cube from any position um, as I said before so there you have it um, again it's called solve it the app uh, it's called solve it uh, just give it a try and uh, see what uh, you can do with it or try to solve your cube in that way so uh, so yeah uh, do like comment and subscribe uh, thanks for watching and uh, yeah